Hi, this is Chris Gould with Geeks on Tour, and this Show Me How tutorial is on Picasso 3, just looking at the basic library view. That's the primary view in Picasso 3. I want you to notice the position of the different commands. There's the top over everything, there's the top of each folder, and then there's the bottom with the picture tray. And then there's the menu. There's some things that don't have a button, and you'll have to go to the menu. So here's what I mean. I'm in Picasso now, and this is the library view. Library means when I'm looking at all the pictures. Down here, over on the right-hand side, it's just all your pictures. You could scroll through and, in my case, see thousands of them. And there's all sorts of different command buttons. Let's take a look at the, let's go systematically here. All the way at the top, you have your menu bar, just like almost every software on your computer has a menu bar, and there are commands on those menus. And we'll look at some of those in, in future videos. In the upper right-hand corner is where it tells you whether or not you're logged in to your web albums, as I am. Then the next row down, these buttons apply to everything. Notice they're, they're at the top. They're above all your folders and collections. They're above all your individual pictures over here. So it has to do with the overall Picasso use. You can import from a camera. You can create a new album. You can look at your folders in flat folder structure or in tree. You can ha you have some choices about how you view your folders in this drop down. This one is about taking video. These are the filters of how you can see all of your pictures. So if I click on the star, I will no longer see any pictures in the library view except for the ones that are starred. If I click that again, it goes back to seeing all of my video of my pictures. If I click on this one, it filters to only those pictures that have been uploaded to the web album. That's what the little green arrow is for. I uncheck that and it goes back to all. This one is really <laughs> new. Show only photos with faces. This is a brand new feature in Picasso 3. And this one is show only movies. And I do have a fair number of movies. And you can tell the movie by this little piece of film strip in there. I'm going to uncheck that. And at the far right, this is our search field. Now in the middle, with the actual albums, I mean folders, <laughs> important not to get albums and folders mixed up. These are folders in here. And each folder has a set of buttons. See the play or the photo collage or the create a movie or the create a gift CD or select just starred, sync to the web or share. Those buttons apply to just the pictures in that one folder. Let's go to a different folder here. So if I click play, it means play the pictures in this folder. And this is a slideshow playing. The bottom, these all apply to the picture tray, to whatever photo is selected. So if I select the photo of main, I can upload it, email it, print it, export it, shop for pictures on using it. I can blog it, collage it, make a movie out of it, or geotag it. But these buttons won't do anything unless there is something in the picture tray. It does seem impossible to not have anything in the picture tray, though. Uh, you're at least on a folder and whatever is in the folder is selected and that is what will be uploaded, emailed, printed, exported, etc. You get the idea.